previous message. Uh, yeah, the other Chinese. And I open up the save there. Was oh, dang, dude. Jeez, that's crazy. Uh, can Zygarde learn Rock Smash? I don't think so. If anything, I will catch a Pokemon and then teach it Rock Smash. But I wouldn't. I wouldn't want Zygarde to learn Rock Smash anyway. So if anything, I will catch a Slave Pokemon. He can learn Rock Smash, but honestly, with me. Yeah, you can learn Rock Smash, so. I'm not gonna teach him Rock Smash, so. What I'm gonna do. What I'm gonna do is. I am going to catch a Pokemon. I'm gonna go on PK Hex again. Actually, you know what I should do? I should do instead of doing it now. I'm gonna catch a Pokemon now. I mean. Um. Give it Rock. Um, cast a Pokemon now, change to level 1, change the, change the name to Doggo, do all good, good jazz, so yeah. Okay, let's do that. Do the best, I can learn such, ooh, true, 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 you're right. Sure, I can change it back to level 1 and I can learn everything. You're right. That's who I had on my HM save last time on my regular game. So, let's see if we can catch the things again. What are we supposed to do, hmm? Where are we going again? In Mount Chimney. Stay chased out and you'll get spoiled by Archie. Mount Chimney? It'll be a long walk around 112. To get there, I wonder if I should buy lunch first. Yeah, Zigzagon is like the perfect slave. See, I want to see where the grass patch is first. Let me see where this grass patch is first, and then I'll change to doggo. Hopefully, Zigzag is like right around the corner. If it's not, it's not. So, again, what can I do? I'll just catch pretty much anyone on Pokemon, and I could actually put the. I could put. Any move on it, so but it'll be best if I can go open. Can you learn Rock Smash? Get something that learns like surf and that's for later. So, if anything, I'll just you know, gen it in it. I'll just make sure it's teaches legal moves. <laughs> can he? Can he be found here? Open. I'm gonna see if we can learn Mark Smash. He can't run in Mark Smash, so. Please live. Woo! Oh my. Are you kidding me? Okay. No worries. Nice. 
Nice. Okay. Perfect. So we're gonna. What we're gonna do is basically. Um, what we're gonna do is we are going to switch this to level one. We're gonna switch this gold to level one. So yeah. And then I am going to go into and go into the Pokemon Center and save again. Change the Gulf into level one. Give it Rock Smash. Actually, I'll give it Rock Smash right now. Uh, I like your Pokemon X and Y, actually. No! It's your first Pokemon game, nice. Okay, and now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna switch it to level one. Okay, we got Doggo for life. Dog up for life over here. Do do do. Because I don't want it on. I don't want that thing on. Because that ruins my. That ruins the stuff. Ooh, and you know what? Um, maybe I'll catch uh, a Wingle. Maybe after, just so you know, he can learn Surf and Fly. That's another good thing. Wingle, surf, and fly, so that'll be good. A decent nature for um, our Zygarde. I mean, for our Mudkip, which was now, which is now a Zygarde. So, yeah, that was actually decent. Because we didn't switch the natures or nothing. Because I said I was going to, but then I realized, oh, you know what? Why just not keep it? There we go. 
Nice. Ba-dum, bump, ba-dum. All right. Still going up on a Tuesday. Turn up and up on a Tuesday. Just checking to see how you are doing. Oh, thanks, Johnny. I am doing okay. Doing fine. We are still with our Zygar solo run over here. Appreciate it, though. Oh my god. That flinch, though. We're still living, luckily, so yeah. Now it's gonna be slowing down. That's gonna be slowing down. All right. Dragon breath. Ooh. Nice. Bum bum ba dum bum ba dum. <clears throat> right, one twelve. Ah, oh. Mikey. Look, right up there. That's our chimney. It sure is big. No, more like huge. It totally takes my breath away. I love to see to take the cable car all the way up to the top from there. Mm, hey, Mikey, don't your Pokemon seem a bit rage around the edges? Here, let me give you a little boost. All right. Oh yeah. Here, take this too. Oh yeah, we got strength. That's why I'm doing, doing nothing right here. I'm supposed to be on my way to the follow board to visit Professor Cosmo. I'm off for now, Mikey, but let's go next time. Pretty sure he can. Pretty sure he can. Let me see. Maybe he, I don't think so. Actually, I don't even think he's like on strain. Yeah, he came in on strain. Oh well. It's all good. I can get eat some fruit. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Some honeydew, melon, and strawberries. Okay. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. That did six damage. Who would win an eating contest? Swallow or Snorlax? Snorlax, definitely. 100%.
Rumble, mumble, rumble. Fast, just pick the line, scramble. I do have to, pretty sure I'm gonna have to um, give a Pokemon strength too. That'll be pretty much the zigzagoon. Feels bad. Maybe the hiker? Oh my god. That's not right. Oh, that was me. Yeah, that, that was a bit mean. Mm. Ooh. Night two. Level 23. Awesome. Oh my goodness. Alright, the ammo. I love this guy. Twenty-one, okay, good. Not even bad. Not even bad. Like you should play through the background. Oh my god. You know, I'll take it. you know how long it'll take? Because since he's not obeying me. Show me how much he's tough in the Pokemon. I don't know, dude. Maybe it just him out. That'll be boring. True. It's all good. And now I'll pretty much take quick like that, like. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Take out. Okay. Five. I, really, I have not. I have not used one yet. Ooh, 
Oh my god. Uh oh. There will be enough space here to build a crazy super place. Oh, my name's not Arune. Yo, my young Pokemon trainer. What can I do for you, hmm? What do you mean? You didn't ask for anything, but your heart did. No, no, I'm only the child. I always ask for me. Name's Oren. Put her there. You know, we're born and 25 years old. Spent the last 11 years trying to find myself just a vagabond search of dreams. I'm wandering around Hoenn, trying to find a place where it's really boring. That's right, super secret base. Tries for it. Yes, it is. Uh, you don't know about secret bases? What kind of life is that? Too sad, little bro. Time for a little lecture from Uncle Arona. Let's start with the secret base is which is adventure, romance, awesome, for real. It's the best place to chill. You, your pals, let you hang out. Since you got this chance, you ought to learn how to make one. Uh, let's take this. We got secret bat, uh, secret power. All right, I was almost about to say secret battle. Secret power can also help you find hidden entrances and hidden places. These entrances, they're full of hidden entrances. All right. That's why I like to throw some spice in there. Call them secret spots. Like this, see? This right here is a secret spot. Doesn't look like you could just climb up this tree. This is exactly the kind of place to bust out with secret power. Oh yeah, I never get tired of that. And that's that. And that's all there is to finding secret spots and creating the entrance to the secret base. This move is crucial to having a secret base don't forget now. Oh yeah. Apparently. I just want to go. Don't explain to me. Mm -hmm. Not a bad layout. See, find each secret spot. You'll find a place like this. They come in all kinds of shapes and sizes. So basically, whenever you find a secret spot, you ought to at least check it out with secret power. Just think someday this place could be somebody's secret base and all got to read and filled with goods and friends. I really love to see it like that. Yeah, same. Wait a second, but who in the world are you? Ah, right. Sorry, Mikey. Sorry about that. I just got on such a roll. So then, Mikey, how about I give one more tip? When you feel happy about something, you gotta express your feeling. Put into words, I'll cheer, it'll cheer everyone up. So how about you tell me, huh? Come on, tell Uncle Orin what you say, you're totally thrilled. Yay. Wait, so yay? That's good. No, I, no, I ask you, isn't it obvious? It's because I already see already that there's plenty in your future to be happy about. Uh, that's just how we roll in secret base life. Every day is full of happy adventures. Oh yeah. Hmm. Now I gotta go ahead and make a secret base right here, but I got, I get the feeling this lay cut could be even better for you, little bro. Guess I'm gonna have to leave the spot for you. Literally. This will be your secret base from now on, little pal. It's yours now, so decorate it, destroy it, do whatever you want. Whatever floats your boat, right? Alright, decorating. Can you decorate some... Ah, uh, too much speaking. Your secret base will magnet play some and living up here to your base a bit. Hope you fly, yes. I get ya. 
that there's a PC. This is where you find your decorations. Not only if you probably have much right here, I'll give you some. Ah, get me the heck out of here. All right, one last thing. You can do more than make your own secret base. You can visit each other, people's bases for a bit of fun. If you find a base that belongs to someone else, check it out. And here's the real point. When you check on someone's base, collect the flag, find right next to the PC. Hey, something good might come off it. Looks like there's something about to hit the road and seek them search for a secret base. Goodbye for now, but hopefully I'll see you again, Mikey. If you need anything, just try it. Try dropping in the secret base guild or fortress. Fortress, yeah. Oh my god. So much reading. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. Tutorials are amazing, dude. Oh, you and your Pokemon must. Wow. I need a wingo. One flying surf. Attack, should be good to go. Rosalian. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe by figuring it out. <laughs> I don't know though. Or reading the instruction booklet, which was helpful a long time ago. Hey! The roads are pretty long here, huh? I got tired of that. I had to make a little break. Mikey, your Pokemon look pretty tired and stuff. Let me get that. Oh, thank you for one measly Pokemon. But thank you, though. See, oh, there, that's better. I'm all right, Professor Cosmo. He's saying it's for research on. Yeah, phew. He was working on a project with my dad, Um, I mean, Professor Birch, on how meteorites might affect Pokemon. Enough dawdling. I think it's, uh, not, it's not much farther. The Falibur. Let's get one last push. <laughs> 